When you want to store data at the session level inside the user browser, but data that it's not in your backend, you can use variables. Variables, you can find them inside data, variables, and add a variable. You can give it a name, for example, display form, and give it a type. So it could be a string, number, boolean, object, array, or query string. And basically, you will give it a um, default value, and you can change this value inside the app workflows, for example, and uh, the application will react on real time according to these variable changes. So for example, I will use a boolean, use the default value to false. I can say that this whole form don't display if the, um, the value is false. So to do this, I would do, I would go to display, bind it, JavaScript, and return um, variables dot display form. Okay, so it's not displaying anymore. But I want, let's say I want to change this and display the form again. Let's bring a button here. Let's call it display form. And then on click, create a workflow that will change the, the value of the variable. So on click, choose an action, change variable value, display form, and set it to true. And now if I go to preview, my form is not displaying because the value is true. And to, to play with this, I can also go inside the navigator, on the top, in variables, and here change the value of all my, my variables. And if I get it to, fall, to false again, the form is not displaying, and true, it's displaying.